I was living a healthy lifestyle, which I'd done my entire life because I wanted to live into my 90s and irritate everyone I possibly could. And I'm suddenly told that I have cancer and not just any cancer, but a rare cancer. It looked like it was probably cholangiocarcinoma. My mortality was going to be three to six months without treatment or six to 12 months with treatment. I finally just said, okay, we have to take action. We have to figure out how we're going to get through this. I had found out I had options. I found out that immunotherapy was a wonderful option to have and a wonderful tool for my toolkit. Thankfully, my oncologist found the Topaz-1 trial, which combined two different types of chemotherapy with immunotherapy. And he said that the immunotherapy would make it better and would give me a better quality of life. Sure enough, taking the Dervalumab or Emphenzi along with the chemotherapy made it tolerable for me. While it was not a skate in the park, it was nothing like I thought it would be. My doctor doom and gloom had become my doctor hero. <laughs> Whenever I was able to get my scan done, my first scan done, and there was shrinkage, and I just, I just started crying. I was so happy because that gave me so much hope, and it still does. I'm still doing the immunotherapy regimen. It's worked wonders for me and I'm still here 14 months later. If you're not happy with your current regimen and you're not getting immunotherapy, ask your doctor if there is an immunotherapy that your particular DNA marker in your tumor would target. What biomarker testing can do is open up a whole new world of treatments, of clinical trials, of things that might save your life. I've recovered from my Y90 procedure, which was a month ago. I mean, I'm feeling great. I've been getting out. The weather's nice now. I've been getting out and walking some, and so I'm very hopeful. And I've outlived that 12 months.